and Ann has asked to share a few words, so I'm going to hand over the microphone to Ann. Well, I can speak for Jay and others. Um, I've been with this church 22 years, maybe, and none of us are as old as those years would suggest. Um, I just needed to tell you something that I grew up with a professional musician and there were certain ways you did things that would line them up, march them out kind of music. So when I came to St. John's, I could not believe how freeing it was that it was okay to not be exactly on point with everything. You didn't have to know all the words to the songs. The songs came from a lot of different traditions and there was a performance ethic which was you get feeling the spirit and you're just going to keep going and keep singing until the spirit tells you it's time to slow a bit now. Uh, this choir experience and the church experience released a whole part of me that I had never allowed to give room to. And uh, I hope that the spirit will allow each of you to grow and expand in ways that you never imagined that that you would. My husband passed away somewhat unexpectedly about five years that I've been in the choir. And this church, this church showed up. I mean, they came out. They brought fans to the gathering. <laughs> they held on to me. And uh, we used to circle up, and we, maybe we should do this again. We used to circle up after choir and just let people tell about things that were happening in their lives. And um, so this is a powerful place. And I'm, I'm, I appreciate everybody who has made it so. And I'm excited about the power that you all are bringing to life in the community today. Thank you very much.